object, we also have a bunch of you know, examples and samples for UI. The thing about the UI is, you know, if you want to build a mobile app and you want to have a certain kind of UI, you want to do that again in another mobile device, it's kind of hard. You're trying to rebuild it again and again. Uh, so we have been kind of working on this uh, thing called a lightweight UI toolkit, and I call it Lewit. And let me tell you, no marketing was involved in naming that thing. So I'd like to welcome here, Yuav here. So Yuav, what is Lewit? Hi, G. So I, I can be blamed for the name. <laughs> so actually, Lewit is a UI library that is bundled together with your application and allows developers to overcome a lot of the challenges you talked about in creating compelling and consistent Java ME applications. Let's see it. So here you see Lewitt running on the Sun Wireless Toolkit. A lot of the features here you'll recognize from Swing. Actually, Lewitt uh, was inspired by Swing in its design. You have rendering, layouts, tabs, and more. We also have uh, cool transition effects. Um, for example, uh, we have the fly-in, we have cube, 3D transition. Very nice. We also have um, rotate effects. Check this one out. Uh, we also have advanced support for themes. So one of the things that carriers and service providers are looking for is to have the ability to brand applications. Uh, so we have a theme manager that basically allows you to change the look of your application on the fly. You could also download new themes over the air, and we have a visual tool that you can create themes with. So are we going to see it on the phone? Yeah, sure. So actually, I have um, three handsets here. One of the greatest things uh, about Lewit is that it runs on deployed, already deployed mass market devices. Here I have, for example, the Nokia Series 40 handset. Um, as you see, it runs consistent with the Motorola Razor device and the Sony Ericsson one. I actually have my own personal Sony Ericsson device, so you can see that these run, run consistently. I can also show you the transition effect running on the Series uh, 40 handset. For example, we have the Rotate here as well. Check this one out. Okay. Very cool. So how do developers get access to this thing? So actually, we have, uh, are now making public a project on Java.net. There is an early access binary everyone can download and play with. We also integrate it as part of the Sprint Wireless Toolkit. Um, so developers could download it with the Sprint Wireless Toolkit and play with it. I actually have a quick... Please, let's take a look at that. Yeah, so here we have the Sprint Wireless Toolkit running. And basically, we have the lightweight UI toolkit demo running here. We also have more effects. Very cool scrolling effects. So you know there's got to be a story about open source here somewhere. Come on now. Yeah, well, <laughs> actually, we are going to open source this in the summer. And we're very happy to share this work with the community. And we're looking forward for the community's participation and feedback. Very cool. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, Jeet. Absolutely. So, uh, 